Today I'm going to show you how to edit your Vista Bubble screensaver to make it look a little bit better. Now if you right click any blank part in your background, go to personalize, go to screensaver, and select bubbles. You're going to notice a few things. First off, in your settings menu, there are no settings. And if you click preview, your bubbles are transparent and the shadows on them aren't very intense. Well, we're going to change this. Go ahead and X out of these two. Pull up your start menu, and in the search bar right here, type R-E-G-E-D-I-T. A program will pop up called regedit.exe. Go ahead and open that. When prompted, click continue. Now, we're going to find our screensavers. First off, you need to click H key underscore current underscore users. Go to software, then scroll down and find Microsoft. After you found Microsoft, you want to scroll all the way down here and go to Windows. In Windows, go to current version and find your screensavers. Go to bubbles. Alright, so this is your bubble screensaver. There's a couple things we need to do in order to make it look better. First off, just right click any blank area right here in this window. Go to New, and go to DWORD 32-bit value. We're going to rename this first one Material Glass, M-A-T-E-R-I-A-L-G-L-A-S-S, -S. no spaces. Then you're going to double click it, and make sure the value is set to zero. Click OK. Now we're going to right click again, select another DWORD 32-bit value. And this one's going to be show bubbles. Go ahead and double click it. And this value we're going to change to 1. Go ahead and right click new D word 32 bit value. And we're going to have this one called show shadows. Go ahead and double click it. And this value we also want to be 1. Make sure all of these options that you just created are one word and have no spaces. If they have a space in them, they won't work. Also make sure they're spelt correctly. Let's go ahead and X out of this. Now we're going to right click the background again, go to personalize, and we're going to check out what changed. Now if we go down to bubbles, you're going to notice a couple things. Now the bubbles aren't see-through. The shadows on them are darker. And, you know, overall they just look really a lot better. Again, thank you for watching, and check back for more updates soon.